In the dark, crime-ridden streets of Gotham, Batman faced a new and unprecedented threat. Bane, already a formidable adversary, had become something much more dangerous. He had traveled through the multiverse, arriving in the city of Queens, where he encountered and defeated the symbiote known as Venom. Using his own supply of venom to control and extract the symbiote's strength, Bane had returned to Gotham, now a monstrous fusion of both his original power and the symbiote's strength. Batman first learned of Bane's terrifying transformation during a brutal encounter. Bane's newfound abilities overwhelmed Batman, leaving him battered and barely able to escape with his life. Realizing that he needed more than his current capabilities to defeat this new threat, Bruce Wayne activated his high-tech communication device to contact Tony Stark, a genius billionaire from another universe, who could help. The holographic screen flickered to life as Tony Stark's face appeared. Bruce, long time no see, what's up? Bruce's voice was grim. Tony, I need your help. Bane has become something else. He merged with a symbiote and now he's a killing machine. I need an upgrade, something that can match his power. Tony's expression turned serious. I heard about the symbiote in Queens. That thing is no joke. Meet me in the Mojave Desert. I'm on a mission, but I can make time for you. Bring your suit. Batman navigated through the multiverse, arriving in the scorching expanse of the Mojave Desert. As he approached, he saw Iron Man's suit glinting in the sun. Tony Stark stood beside it, working on a portable lab set up amidst the sand dunes. Tony looked up as the Batplane landed. Nice ride, he quipped. Ready for an upgrade? Bruce stepped out, his cape fluttering in the dry wind. I don't have time for small talk, Tony. Let's get to it. Tony nodded, his usual smirk replaced by a look of determination. All right, I've been working on a new arc reactor. It's not just an energy source, it's a game changer. As Tony worked on Batman's suit, he explained, this arc reactor will boost your suit's capabilities in multiple ways. Enhanced strength, increased agility, and near unlimited power for your gadgets. It'll also provide a regenerative power field to heal minor wounds and a cloaking device that can make you invisible to the naked eye and most surveillance systems. Bruce listened intently. And it can help me take down Bane? Tony looked him in the eye. With this, you'll be able to match him, maybe even outclass him. Just don't forget who you are under that suit. It's not just the tech that makes you Batman. Bruce managed a rare smile. Thanks, Tony. I owe you one. Tony chuckled. Just make sure to invite me to your next black tie event in Gotham. I hear those are quite the spectacle. With the upgraded suit, Batman returned to Gotham. The city was in chaos, with Bane rampaging through the streets, his new powers making him unstoppable. But Batman was ready. The confrontation took place in the ruins of an old cathedral. The eerie silence was broken only by Bane's heavy footsteps as he approached. His voice boomed through the hollow structure. Batman! Ready for another beating? Batman stepped out of the shadows, his suit glowing faintly with the arc reactor's power. Not this time, Bane. You've taken it too far. Bane charged, his movements a blur. But Batman's enhanced agility allowed him to dodge and counter with precision. The arc reactor powered his punches and kicks, each blow landing with devastating force. The fight was brutal and relentless. Bane's raw power met Batman's newly enhanced abilities in a series of explosive clashes. The cathedral shook with each impact, debris raining down as they fought. In a decisive moment, Batman activated the cloaking device, disappearing from Bane's sight. Confused and enraged, Bane lashed out blindly. Batman reappeared behind him, delivering a powerful blow to Bane's exposed spine, causing him to stumble. As Bane struggled to regain his balance, Batman unleashed a final, devastating punch powered by the full force of the arc reactor. Bane crashed into the ground, the symbiote's influence flickering and fading. Gotham's Dark Knight stood over his fallen foe, breathing heavily. It's over, Bane. This city is under my protection. Bane, defeated but still defiant, glared up at him. This isn't the end, Batman. You know that. Batman narrowed his eyes. Maybe not, but for now, you're done. With Bane incapacitated, Batman signaled for the GCPD to secure the area. As dawn broke over Gotham, the city began to breathe a sigh of relief, knowing that their protector had once again triumphed against the odds. Back in the Batcave, Bruce reflected on the battle. The arc reactor had given him the edge he needed, 
but he knew that it was his determination and resolve that truly made him Batman. And as long as there were threats to his city, he would always be ready to face them. <laughs>